New York Jets quarterback Aaron Rodgers has a sprained lower left ankle but should be able to play against Buffalo next Monday night, coach Robert Sala said. Sala confirmed the injury Monday morning after Rodgers said following the Jets' 23-27 loss to the Minnesota Vikings in London on Sunday that he sprained the ankle while taking a big hit in the third quarter that left him clutching his left leg after it turned awkwardly. He's dealing with a low ankle, but all the preliminary stuff says he'll be fine, Sala said during a video call. It brought back eerie memories of the quarterback writhing on the MetLife Stadium turf after tearing his left Achilles tendon four snaps into his Jets' debut last season. The team will continue to evaluate Rodgers, who also dealt with soreness in his left knee last week leading into the game. There were a lot of things that made some noises on the way down, Rodgers said after the game. The Jets, 2-3, will host the AFC East rival Bills, 3-2, next Monday night and New York could share first place in the division with a victory. The 40-year-old Rodgers should benefit from having an extra day to heal after being sacked three times and being hit 11 times by the Vikings. That came a week after Rodgers was brought down five times and hit 14 times in a loss to Denver. I talked with him last night and he's doing fine, Sala said. Obviously, he's a little banged up, but he feels good. Tyrod Taylor began warming up when Rodgers got hurt and headed to the medical tent. But Rodgers turned around and headed back onto the field when a roughing the kicker penalty on Minnesota during a punt gave New York the ball back. He played the rest of the game, but appeared hampered by the injury. Rodgers finished with his worst performance as a member of the Jets, going 29 of 54 for 244 yards and a touchdown but tied a career worst with three interceptions, including one on New York's final possession deep in Vikings territory as they tried to drive for a potential winning touchdown. The game marked the first time in his 20-year career that Rodgers had two passes intercepted in the first quarter. Andrew Van Ginkle picked off his first errant throw and returned it 63 yards for a touchdown. Rodgers who became the ninth player in NFL history with 60,000 yards passing in regular season games, has seven touchdown passes and four interceptions in five games this season.